Hi, welcome back to the Lotus Flowering of Elite Human Potential. Today I would like to talk about something called autodidact. Now what it means? It means that you are learning yourself. You are your own master. This is one of the very profound statements I've learned and I've heard somewhere which I really liked. The training is nothing. Will is everything. How much desire, a deep sense of desire you have to learn it to train yourself every day. You have to get up in the morning and train yourself every day. Because once you start training yourself, when you will have deep sense of focus to achieve something, you are unstoppable. Nobody can stop you because you are kind of monitoring yourself, you are kind of being critical about yourself and you are working continuously on this. This is a very beautiful story we all know about Eklavya one of the finest archer ever lived on this earth. And stories are being told in different perspectives, different understanding. To my mind, it is a story about will, that I want to learn it. It doesn't matter. So we went to a Dronachar and he asked for it. Dronachar said, no, I can't teach you. I'm training Prince. And he wants to make Arjuna the greatest archer of the world. And he said, all right, no problem. He took this as a challenge. He took this as, as an imperative. Now I need to learn and I have to be responsible for my learning. And the lesson goes like he made the statue of our Dronachar and started practicing in front of him. One day, Arjuna and other guys were going to gather and they saw a dog. And they, they were very amazed because the, the construction around the dog Moss was so profound that it was absolutely harmless to dog, but he could not bark. When this news went to Donacha, Donacha got really, really mesmerized. But at the same time, he was also a little upset that who has done it, because he always claimed and he always said that Archie was going to be the, the greatest archer ever lived on the earth. And finally, they found him. They said, who's your girl? He said, sir, you are my girl. Oh, that's one. You are the greatest archer. Is it all right? And then he asked, what can you give me a Guru Dakshana? Guru Dakshana is a concept when you kind of, you know, respect your guru, your master, your trainer, your coach, to give something back. And <laughs> For the surprise, he asked that can you give the thumb of your right hand? And without any hesitation, he did it. He gave it to him. He knew that after doing this, his training is going to be hampered. He won't be able to practice the way he's been practicing. But then he practiced and practiced and practiced. And legend goes that once he has defeated even Lord Krishna himself. So the story is so profound, so wonderful that we have to make sure to learn in such a way that we start training ourselves every day. Especially when I started training myself in martial art, I realized that the biggest training can happen to your oneself. So please start training.